Evening folks, Nick here from Camper Van Bix. Hope you're all doing well. Quick video tonight, we're going to take a look at the new Van Gogh Sunbeam FlexiLite USB. So obviously working in a, a, a camper van accessory shop, we see quite a few lights. Sadly enough, I got a little bit excited about these when they came through the door. Uh, looking at these lights, I could see me personally using them and they're quite, quite different to some of the other stuff that's out there. Particularly with um, camping, tent camping and a camper van in mind. I can see me using these on a, on a rollout awning uh, to give me some extra light. So we're going to take them out of the box, we're going to have a look at what's inside, we're going to have a look at the specs, and then we're actually going to pop these onto a rollout awning so you can actually see them in action. So, here we have the box itself. So the lights themselves, it says they're 2 metres long, USB powered, 1500 lumens, uh, remote controlling included. Uh, on the back, it tells you that there's actually 120 LEDs in there. There's a, included a 3 meter USB power cable, hook and loop ties, and it's IP67 water resistant. So let's take them out and have a look. So this is what we get in the box. So you've got the actual lights themselves I've got some of these at home some cheaper ones and uh, we'll see how they go oh yeah much better quality yep like a opaque covering on those okay uh, so that's the lights themselves here are the hook and loop fastenings Again, this is where you can becomes to be quite versatile. This one, you got a buckle on one end and hook and loop tape on the other. That's those. The instructions, and then we've got the actual the USB cable with the remote control receiver there. Look. There you go, and the remote control itself, if you have a look at that you've got power on and off, brightness up and down slowly and then quick brightness buttons there from 10 to 100%. Uh, in the bottom of the remote control you've got this little battery saving tab there, look. so obviously you need to take that out before you use them, um, before we pop this on. And again, this is why <clears throat> I was a little bit excited about these lights when they first came through the door. So, most folks nowadays have got a just a little USB power pack knocking about. There we go. So obviously, you can recharge this in the daytime. Put your lights wherever you want to put them. Come out of the night time. Pop this on, and away you go. Let's just have a look at the remote control. There you go. Brightness, dim that down, automatic, there you go, and then 10%, 20, 40, 60, 80, and 100, cool. Right, let's take these, we'll pop them on the a rollout awning and see what they look like.
spokes all on. So you can see the four hook and loop, hook and loop straps there as we go down. And then obviously we can turn this on and off and then set the different brightness levels as you want it. So if I want to do anything different, this hook and loop tape's a little bit long for this application, but it works fine. It's got it really, really tight on there. Um, and I'd probably wrap some self-adhesive hook and loop tape around the power pack and then some onto the awning cassette itself, so there's no chance of that falling out. But great stuff. All the wires are out of the way. So some of the other kits plug into the US, uh, plug into the 12 volt socket on the other side of the sliding door then obviously that's either going through a window or getting trapped so great option yeah cool product thanks for watching guys take care